what's up guys and welcome back to my channel Gina here all right so by now you have already seen part one of this video where I went to the outlet malls and who knew Gucci had an outlet and there were so many other stores as well that I'm like oh my god Ferragamo has an outlet oh my god Prada has an outlet like so many like high-end stores I had no clue they had outlets so anyway the mall was about a two and a half hour drive, which really wasn't too bad when you had a shopping problem and you gonna get some deals. But I am now doing the unboxing for you guys to show you what I got. I did shop at the Nike outlet. Those prices were amazing. Everything was discounted plus an additional 30 or 40% off whatever it was. So I mean, the prices were kind of like like cheaper than even like TJ Maxx or Marshalls um, when they sell Nike items. So it was a really good deal. I also purchased from the Gucci store, the Gucci outlet, and the Prada outlet. So I am going to show those items for you guys. Now, if you want to see what your girl got, stay tuned. All right, all right. Ugh. We gonna start with Prada. I have never owned any Prada items, so buying Prada was like, I was like, okay, all right, Prada. I'm usually like more of like a Louis girl. I'm getting into Gucci now, so I'm like, let me check out the Prada store. And my boyfriend, he loves Prada, like Prada shoes and all that. He loves Prada, so I was like, let me go ahead and check it out. He loves it so much. He likes all the men's tennis shoes. Let me see if I like anything in the women's section. So when I walked in, I was like, hmm, okay. They hip, they up with the vibe. They got cute bags, cute tennis shoes. And then I came across these babies. So this is the box. It's just a dark, what is this? A dark purple, dark brown box. It says Prada Milano on it. And these shoes are in a size 38.5. So it comes just in your regular packaging, I would say. Lots of tissue. And bam, these are them. Let me take them out the box for y'all. So these are the sock tennis shoes. You have seen these type of tennis shoes everywhere. I believe Balenciaga was the first ones to do the sock tennis shoe. Now they have Louis Vuitton ones. I think they have Gucci ones. They have like every high-end brand has followed suit. I've even seen these at uh, Target. They, they pretty much look just like this with just no logo on them. So they're just really basic. I mean, they're black with a white bottom, so they will go with anything. The sole is just a black and white um, sole, nothing too fancy, I guess. The top is like a sock and it is very, very stretchy. It's like a very thick sock material. It does say Prada on the side. So these look cute. When I tried them on uh, in the store, uh, I had on some black leggings and they looked really cute. I think that these are good for like casual days where you want to be kind of fancy you know so i would wear these probably with what i have on now like a hoodie black leggings and then just put on your cute prada tennis shoes and a cute uh bag and then you look like you could you look like money you look like comfortable money but you didn't spend an arm and a leg i don't know how much these costed oh my god did i say costed that is not a word guys Hooked on Phonics does work for you. <laughs> I do not know how much these cost when they were in season in the regular store. I'm assuming these are past season for them to be at the um, outlet store. I don't think they're defective or anything. I think they're just past season. But the price on these, hold on. This is how the receipt looks. It's just a ledger here. I don't know if you can see because it's white. It's a ledger here and then the receipt. But these were with tax. They came out to $3.62 with 64 cents. So they were $3.35 before tax. So I'm like, okay, I had really wanted the balance. Oh, I got something in my eye.
होता है Oh Lord, I got something in my eye, y'all, and it will not come out, but I'm about to finish out this video. Anyways, like I was saying, I had wanted to get the Balenciaga ones, and I believe those are like $800. I was actually considering spending $800 on those, and I'm so glad I didn't because I got these at like a third of the price. Um, I also wanted the Louis Vuitton ones, and those are $1,000. I just, I couldn't br take, bring myself to spending that amount of money on some tennis shoes that I'm not going to wear that often. So, yeah guys, these are super cute. Love them. Can't wait to wear them. Yeah. Uh, now on to Gucci. Gucci, 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 Gucci gang, Gucci gang. Anyway, alright. So, I'm going to show you my boyfriend's Christmas gift first. <laughs> this is his shoe box. This is his Christmas gift from me. He already saw it. He had to approve it because I wasn't about to buy those shoes and he didn't like them. And I had to drive back another two and a half hours to exchange them because you cannot exchange them at the regular Gucci store. I would have had to go back to the outlet. So this is how the box looks. The size. I don't know what the size is. I can't tell what the size is on here. Anyways, he's a mid, oh, they're a size nine. Okay, he's a men's size 10 and they said to go down a size. They're a size nine, so yeah. So this is how it looks, this tissue. Tissue, tissue, and the shoes look like this. They are like just a classic Gucci print monogram shoe with the brown leather. They look really good. I like these. He's going to get a lot of wears out of these, I think. I hope. I spend my coins on it. He better. But um, he was really uh, torn between this shoe or the one that's in my video. If you guys go and look at my video with the gg it had the it was navy blue and white and they had a black and white pair of the low top uh ones so he decided on these and i thought it was a good choice these are these were 289 i don't know how much they cost when they were in the store i'm assuming maybe about 600 dollars or more I don't really know. I've never bought Gucci men's tennis shoes before. So these were $2.89. I thought that wasn't bad. So I was like, okay, Merry Christmas. Oh, and they do come with the, um, they do come with the dust bag. Two dust bags. So that's good. You can store them, put each shoe in a dust bag. So they do come with two dust bags for the men's tennis shoes. All right, guys. So now on to what I got for myself. This right here is the box for my first item. So it's just a little teeny little box. I know you guys can probably already guess what it is by the shape and size. But it is a wallet. It's just the basic monogram print wallet in brown and they had this lighter brown color one and then they had a chocolate brown trimmed one as well. I think they had it in orange too but I can't really remember. I just got this one just because I was in such a rush and I was just like okay this is fine. Anyway so this wallet here they also had leather ones. I didn't know which one to get. So I was like, let me just go with the classic one. I probably should have gotten black leather or red leather, but too late now. So they had a couple different styles of this one. I have a lot of cards and stuff that I carry with me. So I liked that it had extra card room because the other ones, it just zipped and it didn't have the flap here with it for the extra cards. And then it has little pouches here and here. And you can put your money right in this area here. You can put coins, if I can open it. You can put your coins or cash in here as well. Then there's another compartment, more card area right here. Then there's another compartment in the back. So I mean, 
This one, oh, and there's compartments on this side too. So you see right here, right here. So this was more uh, what I was looking for. I need space in my wallet because I do kind of carry a lot of cards and stuff with me. So this to me was perfect. Uh, yeah, I like it. It's really cute. The price. I thought the wallets were gonna be a little bit cheaper to be honest with you, but I was like, I'm here, let me go ahead and get it. This wallet was $3.39. Uh, I know when I was looking at Gucci wallets at the um, actual Gucci store in the Houston Galleria, um, if I'm not mistaken, I think they started off at like $600 for this size. So I was like, okay, half price, let me go ahead and do it. So I am satisfied with my purchase. I like it, it's cute. It could probably even be like a little clutch bag, a little evening bag guys, cause it's pretty, you know, it's a nice size. So I mean, you could probably fit like lip gloss in here because it is like that little, you know, you can probably fit some little lip gloss in here and just carry it as like a little clutch for a night out. But anyway, so this is the first item that I got myself. Why am I saying the first item that I got myself? I already showed y'all some shoes. So this is the second item that I got myself. <laughs> I'm tripping, tripping. All right, now on to the bag. Y'all know I had to get a bag. Y'all see how big it is? Yes, I had to get a bag while I was there. I showed my best friend the bag and she was like, get me one, get me one. So if you see my vlog, me running back to the store to get her one, that's what I was doing because she loved this bag so much. See if I can get it open. All right, so it came in like a plastic layer. Well, plastic baggy. Then it's wrapped in paper. Oh, they have a wrap really wrapped let me just tear into it all right so it comes in this gucci black and gold dust bag oh it's like a backpack y'all because it has two i guess it could be kind of like a little backpack if you can see it has like two strings here well maybe not a backpack i don't know I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but anyway, so this is nice. I like that it has the little straps here that I can carry it easier for when I store it, I guess. But this is the bag. Oh, can't get it out. This is the bag. This is the black embossed leather Boston bag. They did have this bag in other colors, but I was like, let me be safe and just get the black one because I don't have any all black purses. The bag is really big, as you guys can see. It's like the size of a Louis Vuitton, the Speedy, like a Speedy 40 maybe. Hold on, let me compare it to my Speedy. She's been neglected. Let me pull her out. This is a Speedy 35. So I'm just gonna show y'all in comparison to my Speedy 35, if it's around the same size. Okay, they look to literally be the exact same size. Of course, this one's stuffed. That's why the shape looks like that. And this one is completely empty. So this is the shape of, I mean, the size of a Speedy 35, which is the perfect size for me, cause you know, I'm I'm not a small girl. I'm kind of, you know, big, I'm tall. So I like big bags like this. It, um, the straps feel very nice and sturdy. It has all gold hardware. And it does come with a shoulder strap. Comes with an adjustable shoulder strap. The strap does not have the GG print on it. It is just black leather. Let me hook it up so you guys can kind of get a better view of it. So, you can carry it on your shoulder. It's adjustable, so you can wear it crossbody as well because this strap is pretty long. Or you can just let it hang. 
carry it on your arm like this. So I really like this guys. Like I said, they did come in a lot of other colors. They had it in orange, they had it in red. I wanna say they had it in blue if I'm not mistaken, but I know they had it in orange and red for sure. And this is the way the receipt comes. It just comes in a little holder like this. The um, sales associate who helped me out, he put his business card in here. He said I can call him whenever if I wanna request a certain type of bag um, and he'll be on the lookout for it. So yeah, then this is how the receipt looks. So the bag, this bag was $9.49. Yes, it's, yeah, I can't talk. Yes, it is expensive, but for a piece of leather, it could even be used probably as luggage, and it is a designer brand. I think $9.49 is really not that bad, guys. So, I love everything that I got. I would definitely be going to the Gucci outlet again probably in the next few months um so yeah guys you guys 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 y'all need to check out the gucci outlet if you have one in your area i know some people that live in san antonio which this gucci outlet is literally like less than an hour from there and they didn't even know that it existed so check out your outlet stores i'm very happy with my purchases i you know y'all know i really don't like paying full price for anything so this was right up my alley i am still the frugal fashionista don't get it twisted just because i buy high-end items i will mix those in with my fake items as well so ain't no shame in my game check out gucci and y'all let me know if y'all ever been to the outlet if y'all found any good stuff so I am very pleased, I'm happy, Merry Christmas to myself, and yeah. All right guys, thank you so much for staying to the end. Until next time, I'll holla at you later. Bye.